What we're dealing with is not really a migration or a refugee problem. It's a conscious attempt by Turkey to use migrants and refugees as geopolitical pawns to promote its own uh, interests. The people who try to cross uh, into Greece are not people who come from Syria. They don't come from Idlib. They've been living in Turkey for a long period of time. Most of them uh, talk uh, Turkish fluently. They've been fully supported by the Turkish government uh, in terms of uh, uh, the Turkish government providing transfer for them to get to the border. And of course, Greece is doing what any sovereign state has a right to do to protect its border for any illegal crossings. This is what we have been doing. This is what we will continue to do. Now, obviously, we have seen over the past hours uh, increased tension on the border. There have been attempts to actually burn down the fence that we have. Uh, there have been uh, numerous uh, attempts to throw tear gases on our troops. So I'm afraid this is a constant and very systematic provocation on Turkey's uh, behalf, which has nothing to do with the plight of these, uh, of these people. Uh, they're being used by well. Turkey. Uh, and. Uh, and, and this is, a, you know, the result is the scenes that you currently see on the Greek-Turkish border. Well, I don't see why we should be getting any blame for something we've publicly said that we will do. We have every right, Richard, to protect uh, our borders, and this is exactly what we, what we do. We were not the ones who initiated this crisis. Uh, we were not the ones who encouraged people to cross uh, into Greece illegally. Uh, Europe is not going to be blackmailed uh, over, uh, over this problem by Turkey. Mr. Erdogan needs to recognize that. Mr. Erdogan needs to stop um, uh, being uh, the, the instigator of fake news. Um, uh, people, apparently, according to the Turkish uh, minister, hundreds of thousands of people have already crossed uh, uh, into Greece. There are completely false accusations in terms of what's happening at the border. So we're not the ones escalating uh, this conflict, but we have uh, every right, Richard, and I will continue okay. to do so, to protect our sovereign um, uh, borders. Uh, uh, we've succeeded in doing so, and we'll continue to succeed doing so in the future.